Today we've got this beautiful BMW 335D saloon. So this is the three litre twin turbo engine. It's a fabulous engine, super fast and also very economical as well. Being the three litre sitting at motorway speeds, it will eat up the miles and be very efficient at the same time. We'll talk you around the car with some of the lovely options this particular example's got. It's esteril blue metallic with the black leather interior. And we'll start at the front, we'll go around the car. Like I say, I'll point out a lot of the options as we're going around the car because it's got some very nice ones indeed. Um, so starting around the front, we've got the BMW LED lights. Um, so they've got the Angel Eye LED daytime running lights underneath those as well. And you'll see just beneath that, the car's got front and rear parking sensors as well. Coming around the side, we've got these 19 inch alloy wheels, which are diamond cut on the faces and then they're actually a different gray on the interior. It's a very small contrast, but you can just about see it um, on the inserts of the wheels there. They are an M, M Sport wheel as well. And it's also got blue, it's hard to see, but it's also got blue M Sport brake calipers behind the wheels as well. And then again, just on the front wing, another M Sport badge there. So you don't forget what model you're driving. Um, all black window surrounds and privacy glass on the black uh, back three quarters of the car. And then if you have a quick look inside, you'll see the black leather and then the professional navigation screen, which is one of the important options on this car. It's got a lot of features like Harman Kardon, electric heated seats, the Pro Nav like we touched on, and it's just a fabulous specification. If you have a look inside the back as well, you'll get an idea of the room available in the car. You'll quite easily get five passengers in this car. They're a very useful family car, as well as a, a good cruiser and commuter. And then coming round the back, again, it's an X-Drive variant, which means it's four-wheel drive, so good all, all year round, and obviously much better in four-wheel drive with the power that the 335 comes with. Being an M Sport, it's got a slightly more aggressive rear bumper with these sort of flicks that make it look like there's a diffuser there. And then again, the twin exhaust pipes at the bottom there. If I open the boot, you'll see just how generous the boot is in terms of size. So lots of space, it's very deep. There is handles here to actually fold the um, middle row of seats down as well. So lots of space in the boot of this car. If I push the boot down, we'll get inside the car now and we'll talk you through some of the options on the inside. So I'll just jump in. If you have a look on the driver's door here, you'll see all electric windows as you'd expect. Um, and this car's also fitted with power folding door mirrors. So that's what the extra button there is. All electrically adjustable door mirrors as you would expect. And then up on the tweeter here, you've got Harman Kardon. So that again is a lovely option, the Harman Kardon stereo system. And if I turn the car on now, you'll see how smooth it is being a three litre. It fires up, it's very quiet in here. And then again, your sort of traditional displays, the big BMW M Sport steering wheel. So it's the thicker leather on the steering wheel, multifunction as well. So you've got volume controls, Bluetooth controls on this side and your cruise control on the left-hand side here. Big shift paddles. You can drive the car in manual if you wish to do so. Automatic for the LED headlights. So you can turn those on, LED lights will light up. And then on the center console here, so professional navigation screen, as we touched on before, so if I go on that massive uh, navigation screen there, and if I pop the car into reverse, you'll see you've got the sort of 360 degree parking sensor view. So front, uh, you can see where it's just about going green. That will come closer to the car as you get closer or further away from items around you. And then down here, dual zone climate control, heated seats for both driver and passenger, three levels of heat on those. You've got sport driving modes, eco driving modes, uh, lots of different variation. The turn the parking sensors off there if you wish to do so. And then just your controls for this screen uh, just here. Under here, lots of storage, obviously got the key in there at the moment, but lots of storage, even a space designated for your phone. So yeah, just a very nice place to sit. Lots of lovely options. Again, one thing we didn't touch on, the electric seats here, memory for the driver as well. Um, so you can see two settings there for the driver's seat and the M Sport tread plates part of the M, M Sport package on the car. If I jump outside the car now, just to summarize very quickly, the car is finished in esteril blue, as we touched on at the start, the black leather interior, lots of lovely options. It's got a full service history and it's just a fabulous car in stunning condition. Uh, my name's Ben, I hope the video's helped and thank you very much for watching.